what's about over here. Today we're going to be trying out a new game called Path of War. So let's insert my name here. Zabetto. Let's make sure. Yep, I spelled that right. That's a good start. <laughs> so let's get on with this video and let's see what this game is about. I've been looking forward to this game all weekend. Uh, and seems to be a lot of loading going on. Incoming attack, the base needs a commander. I'm entrusting you, Zabetto, to get our defences up before regime troops reach our headquarters. So let's see what it wants us to do. Shop. Build one shrapnel cannon. Let's build that. Wow, so the map looks kind of like squares, like tiles. And it's not asking me to use any gems for now. So let's see this small uh, play. No doubt it's just uh, the same as any other game. Just showing you where your defences fire. How everything works. So it looks like troops are trying to get round the back of the defences that are taken out. And as you can see, both defences survived. Okay, so this menu looks quite cool. And so does the graphics. So we get a reward for that, for surviving the attack. Uh, we're going to have to strike back by the looks of it. So let's build a training centre. I'm guessing this is a barracks of some sort. So five seconds. Well, it went back to five seconds. <laughs> So that's built now, we get a reward for that, it's another 10 gems. Okay, let's carry on, send scouts. So let's tap this building here, let's scout it. Seems to be a lot of loading on this game. Okay, let's see what this button does now. So tap on our units. It wants us to deploy it there. Okay, so one group there, one there, one there, and one there. Now, I'm not sure why it's saying the arrow's going up. I'm guessing that's where the troops have got to go to, some form of headquarters. Seems to be doing fine for now. Let's get another group there. Why not? And we should be able to take this space out any second now. I don't see some form of fast forward for this game. I do like the graphics uh, and the tiles as well. I think there's going to be a lot of strategy in this game. And I do love strategy. So let's have a look here. Sorry about that. All seems there was two cats fighting outside. What can you do? Live recording. <laughs> so let's get on with this video. Uh, reward 25, head back to base, your headquarters is ready for upgrade. Okay, let's go back to our base. Let's upgrade our headquarters. Five seconds, really short build timer. And as you saw there again, it goes down five forward and jumps back to five again. Don't know if that's a bug. Okay, so what we unlocked. Hit continue. They like to give out these gems, it looks like. Okay. Let's have a look see what we've got to do now. Attack another base. I guess so. So let's attack. And let's see if it lets us figure out strategy ourselves. I guess not. One there, one there, one there. Guessing two groups there. Oh, we've got these units as well. And again, it's saying deploy there. I'm guessing the further you go, then the higher up you can deploy. So can we deploy here or there? No. I'm guessing that's all the troops we have. I really do like the look of this game. Can I deploy again? Yes, we can. Deploy again? No. So I don't know why the troops seem to disappear off the map there on the left-hand side. I think it's going to take some getting used to, but I like it so far. Refill. Do we have to? <laughs> Do we have to spend resources already? Uh, I guess so. So we wait for that. We get more gems again. Okay. Let's use that loot to upgrade your training center. So I guess we go back to base, which I believe is that button there. No. Go back again. Oh, there we go. So now we can upgrade our training center. Five, four, back to five again. I'm glad it's not asking us to spend the gems, but it is showing there. 
So we get rewards. Ah, so they're points to deploy troops in battle, I believe. The more we go through this game, the more we're going to learn. Uh, okay, what we've got here. So we've got uh, infantry men specialise against structures. Infantry squad specialise against infantry. Um, okay, let's upgrade the first one. So we'll get a reward for that. Ten gems again. And it's 30 seconds. But the other still are still threats. Take them out, but be sure to secure their steel supplies. Okay, we're not going to wait for this for 19 seconds. I'm going to quickly pause it. Okay, so it won't let me upgrade the next troop as there was not enough resources. So let's try and attack this base. And let's see if it wants me to go a certain way. Okay, so it looks like I get to choose which direction I'm going to go in. So let's try and go on the left side. There. Two groups. We get a group of them. And perhaps a couple of groups there. Maybe try these troops here at the back. Not sure how this is going to go, but we shall see. Can we deploy again? No, we can't. But we seem to be taking resources and destroying defences. Looks like we can shoot the defences at a certain angle, but they can't shoot us. So it's going to take a while to figure out the mechanics of this game and how it all works. Still works plundered. 60. No losses. Which is good. So let's go back home. And now what's it want us to do? We've got to attack another base. Okay, let's attack that. Um, okay, let's have a look here. What on earth are these? So let's try and be sneaky and try and attack from one direction. This side looks weaker. So let's hope for the best here. Oh, I've seen that. So the points at the top, it goes down by five every unit that you use. So maybe try and get a couple more of these troops in. Now it's taken out. And I guess we need resources here. Can we deploy it anymore? No. Um, I'm guessing you need to take out that building now to get resources. And we slowly get resources now. Does it happen if you destroy the headquarters? Do you not get all the resources? Okay, so yeah, it's the same as um, Army of Heroes. Once you destroy the headquarters, everything goes. So losses at minus 15 is going to cost us 12 steel, they call it in this game. So it's going to give us a profit of 48 all in all, plus producing command points, 15 seconds. So let's see if it lets us go back to base, and maybe we can order something, or not. <laughs> so okay, let's go for another attack, like it's asking. So now we're back up to 45 points, and let's attack this base here. It does remind me of Bone Beach with the uh, the clouds. Okay, so we've got three in a row there, and two in two, sorry, three in two separate rows. So let's start by maybe deploying three lots of troops or four lots of troops there. And uh, I'm seeming to think they're more like barbarians, these small guys here, and the ones with the guns, obviously at a bit longer range. So we should be okay for this raid. Hopefully, we can now try and deploy some men here. Run out of points for now. And we're going to try and take these resources. Let's use some troops here for a bit of diversion. Is it working? Ah, so you don't get to take all the resources, or do you? Uh, yes, you do. So at least we know that now. So let's refill again. Uh, I definitely like in this game, there's obviously going to be quite a bit to, to learn. It looks like it's got its own ideas, it's not sort of taking it from other people, um, which is going to be interesting to learn. We've got attack again, we're not researching nothing. It just seems like attack, 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 don't it? So let's attack again. Okay, looks like some form of obstacles in the way. So it's preventing you from going that direction, which means you have to follow the direction of the fences in front. So let's start with... Uh, Two groups there, one there, two groups there, and one there. Say so 15 points and see what happens. Is there any problems here? 
we should be okay for now should be able to take these buildings out maybe a distraction here yep we got it one set of troops there maybe i shouldn't try and use all them points might be easier but i don't want to lose it and there we go 35 so we're gonna have to refill 10 of those points um so it seems like for every five points it's four refill and we use 10 points there so it's minus 10 so it's eight still there so now it's 10 seconds to wait can we go back to base yes we can okay so we get another reward as well not sure exactly what they're for but we can try and click on it and find out when it stops asking us to um, follow what it wants us to do let's take the fight on the road by mobilizing your base for travel to do this upgrade your headquarters to level three so let's go back to our base and do that okay let's upgrade 15 minutes i reckon now it might ask us to start um spending the gems and yeah don't give the enemy time to prep use some diamonds to speed up construction and you'll receive even more diamonds as a reward in return so like most games you want you to start spending gems so what you should do is just let the timer run down um it will run down to naught so save them eight gems because you never know they might come in handy and maybe be able to get you a little bit quicker to a new worker what's it say there do you have to buy an additional construction crane so i'm guessing that's what they call their workers which is 50 and there we go so we're going to wait now for the timer and i'll uh, resume play once the timer has gone down to zero so i'll see you all shortly hello all so now our headquarters has finished and we get 15 gems as a reward Precious sets the tempo of war commander. Raid a nearby fuel camp. We'll use their fuel supplies ahead eastward and keep the regime on the back foot. Okay, so it looks like we've got a few new things here. Does it tell you? An oil well. Anti-tank gun. Guided missile. Damage units and buildings within its small area effect affects own units as well. So that's a spell, I imagine. And let's see where it wants us to go now. So we've got to scout first. Destroying power plants during battle will charge our tactical weapon. Let's aim for the power plants to launch the guided missile. So there is the guided missile. Does that work? No. Why is that not working? Uh, okay, maybe we try and deploy our troops. One there, one there, one there. Uh, let's deploy one of each there as well not sure exactly what I'm doing yet we're just sort of guessing and now where I'll be targeting this area here wow I like that get to fire again so we've still got 15 of the stars at the top there hopefully we can beat this base we should be able to yeah without deploying anything else so our troops should be fine and destroy this in a second got troops wandering off the map and we get the oil as well by the looks of it so this is going to take a few plays there we go refill for four just to get the hang of the game seems interesting so far i do like the look of this uh do we go back to base reward i'm impressed sir why thank you by traveling eastward we'll find more valuable sites to loot and get close to the heart of the regime in DC. Where's he want us to go now? Now we've got to click here and travel. There. Okay. That's going to cost 50 oil. Okay. Looks like that's the case. So we get reward as well. Let's raid some more still to upgrade the headquarters and supercharge its radar. Okay. So let's attack this. Okay, so let's have a look here. I've got one defence there, one now. A lot of defence is staggered out there. So let's try and deploy on one side and hope for the best. So let's deploy maybe two there. 
one there. So yeah, they go with this defense here. Keep an eye on things. And should be able to take out this, was it steel tank, oil tank? Okay, we'll keep an eye on things still. Let's try and bomb this area here. So that was quite nice. So taking out that defense there. Can we survive? Maybe can we deploy a troop there? And another one here. And we should be able to take out these defenses. A bit of luck. So our troops now have gone past the defenses. And they've run off. <laughs> um, okay, let's try one missile there. Whoa, we took out two buildings. <laughs> what a shot. Okay, let's deploy one set of troops there. And hopefully they can take this out. And again, time is not on our side. So let's deploy some of these up here. And hopefully we can take it down a little bit quicker. So it looks like we're going to win 50 more metal. Or still, I should say. So we beat that with a bit of a tactical pro-esque. <laughs> Refill 16, okay. So that's going to take 20 seconds. Let's go back to base. And it still wants us to attack. That we're not upgrading nothing? We've got him, surely. Um, so it said something about the headquarters. Whoop. Now we've come out of it. Uh, let's go back. Where is our game? There we go. As you can see, I've got quite a few apps. <laughs> so let's tap there. There is no return button, it seems. You can't use the return on your phone. Uh, the upgrade button is there. Power gain to unlock next head headquarters. Okay, 100 out of 375. So it looks like we've got to attack again. Let's come out of that. Let's attack again. And looks like I've got to attack this one here. Whoop, wrong button. Very sensitive this, I must say. So there's troops now, we've not seen this before. Um, there's a defence there, we're going to try and, I guess, stack our troops on two different tiles. Say so there, and there. But it looks like the troops are now following us. Can we... Maybe drop there, hopefully not kill our own troops. No, won't let us. So we should be okay coming up this side here. Let's get another lot of troops here. Uh, we're on 15 of that gold fist. So let's maybe deploy a set of troops there. And hopefully we can take out these defences while running sideways. <laughs> I, I am really enjoying this game. It is going to take some getting used to, but it does have a good feel about it. it. It's really nothing like I've played. I mean, it's no walls, so it's sort of like a, a Boom Beach or Army of Heroes. Wow, and refill. We have to keep refilling. So it's 25 seconds. Uh, does it want us to go back to the map? Does it want us to go back to base? Uh, what's this here? So, loot 500 still. Done. Collect your reward. Reward is 50. Collect. So that's nice. Uh, how do we return now? Tap the screen. And attack again, I think. Uh, there we go. Second time lucky. <laughs> wow, so this is a lot more defences. Okay. Um, do we come in? No matter what, the troops are going to follow us. So let's maybe... Coming from this left side here. Let's get some of these troops down. They seem to do a bit more damage. Maybe another set there, because the other lot got killed quite quick. So we're keeping an eye on things. I'm hoping these troops here will attack the three defences there. Weakening it, I could be wrong. And we'll keep an eye on things and just see how these troops are going to go. They are going to run off the map shortly. Uh, so these guys seem to do more damage and at a longer range at the back. I would have thought so with the guns. Okay, so we've got 15 of these gold things. I think we are running out of time here. So let's put maybe a set of troops there and there. One more.
And how are we going? We're going good. We're going to be able to win. Let's try again. There's not a lot we can really do. Can we hit that build in there? Hell yeah! And again, I'm really liking this. <laughs> Hopefully we can take this base out. I don't know why the group of troops at the back are doing nothing. Come on guys, there's only two fire in here. Can we hit there, maybe? No? Okay, it doesn't matter, we won anyway. <laughs> this is pure fluke, we're, we're guessing the game. Absolutely guessing. So now at 30 seconds, it's really starting to go up, so I think that's a 5 second increase. Do we have to attack again? Um, what's this plot here? So we do have to wait for the bar at the top, another 17 seconds. So let's go back to base a sec. Can we upgrade anything? No. Oh wow, free. Okay. And let's see what these are. It's a barbed wire, just while we wait for the timer. Uh, damages past an enemy infantry can be run down by enemy vehicles. I guess we're not at that stage yet. Energy field. Uh, there's no info on that. Build a power plant here to generate power. That's probably why. Okay, so let's go and attack again. Uh, 14, that's going to cost us. So what do we have here? Okay, this looks a bit easier, but is it? So you've got two defences there, a set of troops here that will come and follow us, and one at the back there. So let's try and start our way there. Let's get maybe two groups. Why is there a green bar? That's because that's where you got to deploy. <laughs> let's scroll back a little bit, seems really sent. I do like how quickly the screen moves, very sensitive. But it does as it's told, so that's what we want. Hopefully the gun on the left can't reach us, but as I say that, I think it will. Yep. <laughs> but we should have enough troops there to do the damage that we need. The only downfall to this game, I would say, is that there don't seem to be any fast forward button. Come on troops, that's the one. Uh, now, they're <laughs> now they're running off the map. Can we get our troops here? They're going to fire. There we go. So we're on 20, can we deploy one more, try and get this done a bit quicker? There, yeah, so we're going to get this done quicker now. As I say, the only downfall is definitely no fast forward button. It would be nice if they could introduce that into this game. So refill for 12. Wow, okay, only 15 seconds. I guess it's one second per one of these gold fists. I will try and find out the name of it. <laughs> Don't want to keep calling it the gold fist, do we now? Let's go back home. Let's push on command points. There we go. <laughs> so command points are used to deploy units during combat, leveling up the training center, increase the maximum amount of command points. That's good to know. So let's click off of that. And let's go for another raid. That still works. Free the regime. 200 this time, so it's going up. 11 to attack. The other one was 14. Wow, okay. How... We meant to negotiate our way through this. I guess we're going to have to just uh, walk through the barbed wire. Um, so let's, I don't know. One there, one there. Hopefully we can get all four storages. And we need to figure out a way. Can we go there? They, they're going to destroy it when they walk through it? How does it work? So they lose a bit of health. Can we deploy up here? No. So let's get our troops. Let's get some more there. Wow, we've got some energy. Ah, I see now. So maybe if we destroy there. Ah, okay, we've got the grips of it now. <laughs> so let's get two lots of them. One of these. We're probably going to run out of energy and lose, but I guess we learned something this ride. And that is use that missile to get through the barbed wire and I don't think we're going to have any more energy for us to use yeah I think that could be GG unless they take out this building oh we get five more so there's no defences we can win this oh no <laughs> whoops quick destroy it don't kill our troops oh no um, okay now we've got to be strategic and 
let's take out there there wow that's a good shot there as well and we took out the defense Is that no we didn't take out the defense i don't know why we bomb there i do need to get through the middle somehow uh so we've got this one's going to cost seven there next one's going to cost eight but we do need to somehow get there don't ask me how we're going to do this but somehow we are um Yes, I think we can actually. Can we destroy it there? Okay, now we've got a chance. So we've got five. If we deploy it there and there, we should be able to get through without our troops dying. You would think. I hope. Come on, guys. No. <laughs> That's complete foul. Wow. Okay. So we took 64 resources, refill is 36, so it's a long wait. I think we learned something valuable there. <laughs> and uh, it was me that had to find out the hard way. But I guess it's better me than you, right? So let's go back to our base. We're going to try and do one more raid. I'm going to wrap up the episode really early. And uh, we can have another go tomorrow. Because I've been dying to play this all weekend and I've really not had time to play it. And hopefully tomorrow I'll we'll have more time on my hands. So hopefully we can get through um, two episodes of Army of Heroes. An episode of this as well. So let's go and battle. By the time we get here, yep, we should have full energy of command points, I believe it's called. So let's attack again. And now we have an idea of what to do. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So they're all fives there. Okay, can we maybe deploy there? Take out four? I guess we can't deploy it yet. So we take these out. So let's get ready with these rockets. So I suppose once you destroy these buildings, then we'll get some of this purple energy. Right now. Uh, now would be nice. There we go. Another four there. Oh, we're getting there. We're learning. <laughs> We've had to learn the hard way, but we're getting there. So let's deploy it again. Let's get our troops here. And hopefully we can get through and beat this base. Come on guys, there's loads of them here. So that's one defence down. That's the second. And look how much easier it is when you know how to do it. <laughs> and there we go. A nice, quick, easy victory for us. <laughs> so I'm glad with that raid. I redeemed myself a little bit. Can we do anything else but raid? We must be able to... No? Okay. Not sure if we got to do. So let's attack again. Let's see what it throws at us this time. Um. Okay. So there's troops on the right side. There's defences on the left. So I guess we're going to try and come down this way. There. Let's get a set of those troops at the back. We should be able to get there. Keep an eye on Finns. We can't against two sets in a second. Don't need to worry about that building. Keep walking troops. That's it. Quickly, we're going to die in a second. We've got no form of tanks. Can we beat them? We should be able to. Hopefully our men don't run off sideways. We can destroy the space. And we've still got 25 command points left. So that worked rather well. I think I'm slowly getting the hang of this now. <laughs> so let's refill our command points. 10 seconds. Uh, let's go back to base. I'm sure there must be a max amount that you can hold. Or we get rewards. Wow. There's whispers all along the west coast about the blow you've dealt with the regime. Complete more missions to reach headquarters level 4. And then we'll supercharge the radar to reveal the whole region. I can't wait. It's a new mission. Unlock the armoured car. That would be nice. Upgrade your headquarters to level 4. Uh, that's what we've got to do. <laughs> okay, let's hit upgrade. Wow, we're still... Okay. So we're going to try and do another storage full. Is that six hours? 
uh, 40 an hour, local storage 240. So let's click on the X. So the storage is 2,500, production 40 an hour. Let's try it and close that, drag that Y a second because it's in the way. Uh, fuel 2,500, naught an hour, that's no good. Storage 5,000, production naught an hour. So okay, it's saying to upgrade the steel factory. Okay, so we get an extra five per hour. Storage goes up by 30. Um, let's just go for another rate to wrap up the end of this episode. Let's move this back because I'm used to it here. There it goes. Let's attack. Um, okay, let's not attack. <laughs> uh, let's go back to the base. I'm sure it said want me to attack so what am i okay it's telling me where it wants me to upgrade things so let's upgrade and we'll continue this again tomorrow i hope you enjoyed this quick insight into the game and had some laughs at my expense because <laughs> i know i have so thanks for watching all hope you enjoyed this episode and bye for now